All right. Shalom. This is part two. OK, it says. Um, United under one religion, all non-Catholics, many Jews and Moors were therefore turned heretics. They were also known as Moranos. All right. <clears throat> It says uh, the Spanish term for swine, as well as a Muslim converts known as Moriscos. All right. It said the identity of the accusers were rarely revealed to them. Once arrested, the accusers were not allowed legal counsel. All right. <laughs> All right. Subject to unimaginable physical and emotional torture to gain confession, their properties were seized and administered by first by the Crown and later by the German Spectre. About the late 1490, however, King Manuel Porto decided that Jews must be Christianized, or that they don't plantation Christianity. They gathered in groups to lead locations as Amsterdam, Hamburg, London, lands in the New World as they were practicing their religion. All right, they saw the law, statute, commandments. Sorry, we don't have no religion. It said Jewish Jamaica town. Spanish said for Jamaica Jew practice of religion recognition that identity remained a struggle on the Spanish route. Yet the genuine article showed Jews had managed to live until AIDS and 90 Jews, Reverend Historian, long described Jews, 17th century Spanish Jews. Here are Marco Healthy, long lived. They only good have longevity as their fertility to sparing us use of strong liquors, the early rising, and those from God and fish, mosaic laws, sugar, chocolate, all right, whatever, blah, blah, blah. All right, and you can see right here, uh, you see the history, you can read it by yourself, but the point is our people, or in Jamaica, a lot of them descend from the Jews and Moors that was kicked out of Spain and Portugal that came over. All right, and that's the history of it. So honest, so you, you know, there's this bullshit lie of, uh, our people being anti-Semitic, man. All right, it's just it's, just, it's bullshit. All right, it's bullshit, and it's proof we're not uh, no damn Africans, man. All right, so you no know, can't can't run to that. All right. that are like this. Does the First Amendment cover that? Uh, it it generally does. I mean, I, you know, first day of constitutional law, you learn that the speech that you hate the most is the speech that you protect the most because it's such a slippery scale. Once you start policing speech, but name -calling it's a, it's is a not problem. Hate speech when no, you call people. no. Oh, it's and pretty much a group of people. It's pretty protected, but I think. The and first of all, I see the tape. He didn't say Jews were termites. All right. Jewish people, all right, not the real Jews, all right. But anyway, he didn't say the Jewish people were termites. He ain't said, man. <laughs> he just said he anti termite, all right. That's all he said. And the damn devils, man, they just trying to use this to continue try to um, basically trying to spin that uh anti Semitic card, all right. Like I said, this shit is cut up, it's done, it's over with, man. All right. <clears throat> so, um, you know, because if they was the real Jews, why they don't fit not one prophecy in, in, in the scriptures, man? Why they don't fit the prophecies in there? All right. It says Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 40. It said, therefore, shut thou. Well, so lock me get this. It said Deuteronomy uh twenty-eight All right, Deuteronomy twenty-eight, forty-five, forty-six. It said, Moreover, all the curse shall come upon thee and shall pursue thee and overtake thee till thou be destroyed, because thou hearkest not unto the voice of how thy power to keep his commandments and statute command thee. And they shall upon thee for a sign and the one upon thy seed for a right. So all these curses during two they don't fit uh, the Jewish people over there, the Israelis over there, the state of Israel. They're not going through the curses, and, and one of the one of the, one of the, one of the, one of them historically, it said, "Therefore thou shalt serve thy enemies, which your house is sinning against thee, in hunger and in thirst, and in nakedness, and in all the one things." Right? Because they they stripped their Israelites when they came over here to uh, uh, the New World. 
and also the Israelites, the Nordic king, the so-called Native Americans. They stripped all their clothes and everything. They was in one of everything, man. And still today, man, we we in one of everything, man. Because we on the bottom. We in a low state. That's why it's easy for Jake to uh, sell his soul and shit when he hits. You know, he won't be a music producer, actor, something like that. Or even uh, in the corporate world, man. Because we in one of all things, man. We're at the bottom. You know, we hungry all the time, you know. Uh, thirsty. You know, those are people that, that uh, you know, we don't have anything. You know, uh, and naked in one of all things, and he shall put a yoke of iron upon that night to destroy that yoke of iron. Now, when this ever historically happened to those uh, uh, Jewish people, man? Cast an iron upon thy neck. This never, this never happened to to the Khazars, man, the Edomites, who is known to have a cast an iron around their neck. So called Negroes, man. So called West Indians. So called Haitians. So called Native Americans. So called Latinos. All right. We're known for that. Do those uh, uh uh Jewish people they not known that man see where it was said which one fit the curse <laughs> all right stop the lies man all right the anti-Semitic card is cut the fuck up all right it's no good all right me don't want your money no more as Moab said. <laughs> Oh boy. All right. So it says right here, it says Zechariah chapter 9, verse 6. It said, An ambassador should dwell in Ashdod, and I will cut off the pride of Philip. It said, A bastard is what? An unwanted person, man. Esau's unwanted, man. All right. The most I don't want him. The most I don't want him, man. He's unwanted. He's despised, man. Read that, uh, Hebrews chapter uh, 12, verse 16. He despised because when Esau thought he had a birthright, he forsake it, man. He forsake it for a morsel of meat. <laughs> and then, you know, he, uh, and then after that, after we came out of Egypt, man, uh, you know, they, they uh, slaughtered the young, slaughtered the old, slaughtered the fences. We came out of that. We walking out of that, man. Came in. And, and, sl and slaughter our people, man. And then let us go past. Let us go uh, past or do uh, that territory to, you know, our easy route, man. Or where we was had. All right. So that's why the most I had a controversy with, uh, uh, of, uh, with Edom, man. All right. He got a, he, he has a beef with Edom, so-called white people. Starring their leaders, uh, uh, Amalek. All right. All right. So Ashdod is what? Tel Aviv. Today, man. Look at this. Tel Aviv uh, lesbian parade. Israel gay parade. Gay Tel Aviv Israel. Look at this. Gay Tel Aviv 2003. Two years ago. Three years ago. 11 years ago. Look at this shit. Now how does how does fit in like one one prophecy? How how they fit this man? This is just total madness. So this contradicts what the scriptures say, man. It says what well, Michael chapter four, verse one. All right. Michael chapter 4 verse said, But in the last day shall come to pass that in the mountain the house of Israel shall be established atop the mountains. Right? The the uh the kingdom of Yahweh shall be established on uh, uh shall be established in the world, man. Alright? And all the other nations shall be under under Yahweh, man. Alright? But first before that, he gotta send his son, the one hundred four thousand angels, to basically Beat the hell, beat everybody into submission, man. All right, which he will do it was soon around the corner. It should be exalted above the hills, and people shall flow to it. 
And me and Isha come and say, let us go to the mountain of Yahweh and to the house of Jacob. And he will teach us his us his ways. And we walk in his path for the laws that go forth out of Zion, the word of Yahweh from Jerusalem. It says what? For the laws should go forth out of Zion. What's one of the laws, man? Leviticus. It says what Leviticus 20 verse 13. All right. It's a lock. It's a camera I'm trying to let's see. Yeah, it's Satan <laughs> trying to stop this. Well, demons trying to stop this. It says, Leviticus 20, verse 13. It said, If a man also allow a man can as he lies with a one, both of them committed abomination, they shall be put to death. Their blood should be upon them. How is this law going? For? <laughs> what prophecy do these, these uh, Jewish people, Israeli people? Fit as the children of Israel. It said when the real children of Israel should be in the land, uh, there should be laws. Everybody should be following their laws and statute commandments. They bring these laws. They've been breaking it since they got over there, man. Since they boldly uh, established that state of Israel. Right? And you look up the state of Israel, you look up uh, uh, the word Israeli, I mean, it said, sin is in the modern state of Israel. You look at where it's like someone who's connected to Jacob. So the two different meanings, man. All right. Because they like to push uh, in the media. Esau like to try to push that that uh, that he's the original Jews. That he, he it's not true, man. All right. It's not true. Your anti-Semitic card has been cut the fuck up, Esau. It's gone. It's revoked. It no good. You can't spend it no more. All right. It's gone. Look at some right here. Get this for I'll close out, Craig. So there you go right here. All right, so yo. Hi guys, Sam here. All right, so you saw your anti-Semitic <laughs> uh, car is cut the fuck up, man. All right. And uh, today I have a new video. So today uh, my mom took away my Xbox One and took away all my games. Took away my GTA Five. Logged me off my account. Just unlocked my Xbox One put it in a box and didn't tell me where it is. So this is your credit card. And uh this is what she gets. Don't don't touch my Xbox one. <laughs> Nothing about that. Touch my freaking Xbox one. And now I'm gonna look for my Xbox One now that her credit card is destroyed. And a lot of you might be taking it. Oh this is fake. All right, so hey, the anti-Semitic car is cut the hell up, Esau. Shalom.